Hallelujah. Good morning, brothers and sisters. So glad to bring God's word as we begin the day. We begin the day with the word of God. Amen. So God has a word for us this morning. So let's look at the book of Hosea chapter 4 and verse 1. Verse 1 says, Hear the word of the Lord, you children of Israel, for the Lord brings a charge against the inhabitants of the land. Hear the word of the Lord. God is speaking and he expects us to hear what he's saying or speaking to us. God is saying that he's bringing a charge against us. Why is God bringing a charge against us? Because God is unhappy with what we are doing. What is that God is unhappy about? We read from the verse 2 onwards. It says that we are living a life standard by swearing and lying, killing and stealing, committing adultery. They break all restraint with bloodshed upon bloodshed. Therefore, the land will mourn and everyone who dwells there will waste away with the beasts of the field and the birds of the air. Even the fish of the sea will be taken away. Imagine the wrath of God coming so hard. And we know that our God is a kind God, is a merciful God, is a forgiving God. And if this God whose heart is full of love and mercy and compassion, if he is going to press charges against us, to what an extent have we pushed God with our lifestyle? Where are we going wrong? The second part of the first verse, he says, there is no truth or mercy or knowledge of God in the land. Hallelujah. God is so annoyed with us because we are living a lifestyle which has no truth. We are living a lifestyle full of false, false lives we are living. We are living double standard kind of a lifestyle. There is no truth in our lives. There is no mercy. We cry out unto God, God, have mercy upon me, have mercy upon me. But Jesus Christ, he taught us to pray this way. He said, forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sinned against us. Forgiveness and mercy begins from our homes. We forget about that. The husband is not willing to forgive the wife. The, the parents are not willing to forgive the children. The children are not willing to forgive the parents. Mercy begins from home. But we go out and we show so much of love and mercy outside. It all has to begin from home. Nor do we have knowledge of God. What is knowledge of God? It is having a close, intimate relationship with God. Neither of this that we have in us. And therefore God is so angry. This morning I would like to encourage us. It begins right from me. We need to set our lives right with God. We need to live lives truthful. We need to live lives with mercy, the mercy of God being practiced into our lives. We need to get into a closer relationship with God, an intimate relationship with, with God. Live lives which are righteous with God. Let's pray. Father God, yes, Lord, we are living in this world and at times it becomes so difficult to God, even though that we know that uh, things, certain things that we are not supposed to be doing, we, we get indulged in all of this, but the pressures of this lifestyle and this world. God, this morning, oh God, we want to ask you for forgiveness, Lord, that you'd wash us, cleanse us, and Lord, that help us, Lord, to set our lives right with you and get into a closer relationship with you, God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.